Hi everyone, welcome to my corner of the internet. My name is Gwen and today we're back with some more of The Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. Last time we ran around like a chicken with our head cut off. Uh, no, we, we, um, we were visited by the Dark Brotherhood for some reason. Uh, I don't know why. It, 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 it kind of threw me off. I'm like, oh, okay. Um, I don't know why. I don't recall killing anybody, but apparently we did. Let me see, murders. Apparently we got a murder. I don't know where the murder came from. I don't know who we did. We, 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 we murdered. Maybe we murdered ourselves when we lost our face. I, I'm not sure. Anyways, uh, after d d determining that Rufio didn't really deserve to die, um, I, I, f I found no reason why we would, um, I, we would have to kill, uh, Rufio. Uh, we decided, I decided to go back to the, um, the Sanguine, uh, quest. So I'm, we're still on the look for Cyrodiilic Brandy. I don't know why I can't find any. Like, you'd think it would be everywhere. You know, it probably was everywhere. I, I seem to recall finding some, and then... Um, I, 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 now I can't find any. I, I don't know where it is. So we're just gonna, like, walk all over the place. We're gonna go in the- we're, I figure if there's a place that's gonna have the Cyrodiilic Brandy, it should be in the Imperial City. Uh, covered pot, tan jug, a bunch of mead and stuff, like... That's all there is! There's just, there's nothing but wine and beer and ale! Wine and beer- Gen, uh, Gen Zine's good as new merchandise. You're, 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 you're locked. Oh, no, no. Yes, you are locked. You know what? Oh. You're not happy to see me. Hi. Feel free to browse, friend. It's nice to see a new shopper. I was afraid I lost any hope of new business ever since Thorinir opened up. Uh, Thorinir? I think you might be just the kind of person we're looking for. Perhaps you can assist us with a problem we're having here in the market district. Um, okay, start from the beginning. I'll hear it. I'll put it I'll put it in my quest book. I might get around to it. I'm the chairperson for the Society of Concerned Merchants. We formed this group a while back to keep a nice, fair economic balance in town. Not every store is a member, but we're slowly trying to convince them to join. Everything was fine until Thorinir opened his shop nearby. Selling all sorts of merchandise, he undercuts prices like you wouldn't believe. He doesn't always sell what we sell, but it is still a problem. People who buy tend to want to spend their money there. That leaves none for us. It's getting so bad a few of us may have to close up shop. He outright refuses to join the society or even discuss the matter. We are convinced he's up to no good. What we need is for you to case his establishment and figure out where he gets his inventory. Find some proof of his wrongdoing and let us know. We cannot do it ourselves, as he recognizes all of us. The job pays a fair bounty in gold when he is brought to justice. Oh! Unfriendly cups. You know what? Yes, okay. You know what? This actually does sound like uh, something I, I'm, I'm, cu I'm curious to uh, jump in and on. We're taking on the- we're taking on the Walmart of Cyrodiil. There we go. That's basically what we're doing. Uh, anything else you can tell me about Thorinir? I hope you're more successful uncovering his scheme than we've been. Uh, probably will be. Thanks again for your help. We had no other place to turn. I know. I'm pretty- I'm pretty amazing. Uh, do you guys have any, uh, Cyrodiilic brandy by any chance? Just curious. No, uh, actually, I've got a few uh, amulets. Uh, can I sell them to you? Any news about that certain task we discussed? No, 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 I did. Have a I... look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to suit you. I could very warblade. Mm. I like that one. Two handed, though. Um, do I need this glass bow? Not really. Our disposition is too low for you, though. Yeah, we gotta work on a per- oh, okay, let, let, let's, let's chit-chat it up with, uh, Gen Zine a little bit here first. Alright. Let's do this. Jeez. I'm sorry! 66. That works for me. Ch May just I chill. interest you in some of my fine- Alright, we're gonna sell off, um, this jeweled necklace. And this jeweled necklace. That seems a fair price. Uh, let's see, a flawless emerald. That's more- Some gold nuggets. 
You drive off. Oh crap, I still have turpentine on me. I should drop that off somewhere. I really don't think I need resist disease. Honestly, I don't even think I need cure disease. That glass bow, uh... Eh, it goes. Come back and see me again. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go uh, check a thorn Thanks in the shop. Again for your help. We had no other place to turn. No problem. Maybe he's got serodelic brandy. Oh, I'm like, why am I not taking damage? You dumb. You fed it. You fed in the last episode. Right. I forgot about that. Uh, okay, where's Thornier? Thornier's place. Merchants in. Oh, it's in a different place. Okay. Um. All right, let's go. <laughs> Seems you've blooded your knuckles a few times. Oh yeah. Uh, let's. I okay. We'll, we'll follow the quest marker. I I, I I've just been uh, I've been a uh, I've I've been a vampire. Like I've been under the effects of vampirism for so long that I'm just like. I'm weirded out by the fact that I, I can be out during the during during sunlight. It's uh, it's great. Okay, so he's quite quite a little bit way, uh, a ways away. I, the way she was talking, I was expecting it to be like, oh yeah, the shop opened up, up across the street. He's horrible. All right, let's uh, Talos Plaza District. Um, uh, he's uh. Quite a ways away. The Tiber Septim Hotel. Oh, acrobatic skill increase. Oh, we leveled up. Sweet. Wait. Oh, I still have Sanguine selected. I'm a dumb. <laughs> it was right across the street. Wait, where is it? At the copious coin purse. How was I? She didn't say anything about the copious coin purse. See, I, I feel like the only stuff that should be in the uh, I feel like the only stuff that should be in uh, like the new inf only only new information that should be in the journal should be your character's own like inner monologue. It should not your journal should not possess. Uh, external information that Hello you weren't there. specifically told about. Right? Like, I, I've- that annoys me. Alright. Yeah, it definitely looks a lot more put together. Oh, it's, uh... Hey, how's it going? Hey, Thornier. What kind of deal can I make for you today? Oh, you know, I'm looking for some uh, Cyrodiil brandy. I offer the finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. Uh, yeah, if you say so. Uh, I'm looking for... I don't see any... Uh, I'm just gonna take a look around. I'm just, I'm just, uh... Browsing. Uh, what can you tell me about your inventory? What do you sell? What about my inventory? I just asked you. Um... <laughs> I think it's stolen. Okay, okay, let's be a little, a little bit less direct there. Come on. Very nice selection, Thornier. Well, thank you. It's not only a fine assortment of goods, but a bit of a treasure trove. You never know what I'll have in stock. I can see by the look on your face. You wonder where I get all these fantastic items. I'll tell you what I tell everyone else who asks. It's all about who you know. My sources are good, but they are secret. Anyway, have fun looking around, and when you are ready to buy, give me a shout. All right, a crystal plate, unfriendly competition. Goodbye. Hope to see you again very soon. Um. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see what the, let's see if the journal gives me new information. Being a Thornier hasn't revealed any information. Since he's obviously hiding something, I should keep an eye on him and watch what he does after his shop closes. I mean, that is something I could do. Stone pitcher. I'm just, uh... Copious coin purse basement. Bet you got some fun stuff in there. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna sneak my way upstairs. Just gonna take a look around. 
Copious Clumpers private quarters. You know, I bet after a long day at work, you probably come up here and celebrate with some Cyrodiilic brandy. That's what I think you do. <laughs> I like to think that when you fail, like, you just leave the lockpicks on the ground, so this is just like a pile of- Ah, oh, I waited too long on that one. This is just like a pile of broken lockpicks under a lock. Security skill has increased. Alright, what do we got? It's a really nice place you got up here. Got nice things. A hey, gold is immediately goldable. Paintbrush, you thank you. Chest ebony ring, gold. Yeah, thank you. I'll, I'll, I'll take that. Into the wooden door. Is this where you where you sleep? Uh, an interesting setup. I'm not sure I'd decorate things quite like this, but all right, you do you. Uh, anything in the desk? Paintbrush jar. Guide to Bravil. Why do you have a guide to Bravil? Do you, are, do you plan on visiting Bravil? Like I want you want to go vacationing to Bravil? Man humanoid, absorb skill. Detect <laughs> I thought this said detect greater lies. I'm like, oh that sounds interesting. Serenity, the real Baron Zaya. Which is a good read. You should check it out during my uh Morrowind book club. Brief history of the Empire. Darkest Darkness. That's another book we read during our um Morrowind book club. I don't see anything here. Maybe sit down in this basement. Yeah. All right now, he doesn't know where we're at right now. I, I suspect because we're out of sight and we entered the the cell. We're just gonna invisify ourselves. How do you see me? God, why do games do this? This why does this game do this? I can't pick your lock if you're staring at me while I'm invisible. What the heck? You're fine. I'll leave. All right. Now? No, you're still staring at me. Okay. You know what? I'm just going to give him some time to cool off and maybe get his AI rewired or something. Um, we have to wait until, uh, basically until night, right? And we're still morning, so let's go check out another, uh, shop or two. I, I, I got cur- um, I got curious. Um, I, I am curious, present tense. Um, would an alchemy shop have it? Well met. Right? Because, I don't know, it, it's kind of considered a potion. Uh, I think it's right over here, right? The... I mean, it's worth a shot. I don't know where else to look. We've checked bars and stuff. Um, weak potion of fortitude, cheap wine. Whoa, 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 hold up. Wait, where, where, where is it? <gasps> it's in a small bottle! I've been looking for giant bottles! I, I still don't think we've come across any of these. Hi! How are you doing? Um, do you sell it? I have everything for the budding alchemist under one roof. Including Cyrodiilic uh, brandy, apparently. Hey, what can you tell me about Thorinir? Maybe you've got an opinion. Talk to Jensine. She can help you better than I can. Oh, okay. Um, wait, Claudette. I, I recognize you. We've dealt with you before. We've we got good for you. Disposition. Of course. Yeah, we got good disposition with you. Um, I offer the finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. I know I've got some. Oh, there it is. Uh, Cyrodiil brandy. Yes. Okay, that's expensive. Uh, I think I'm just gonna steal it from you. Uh, <laughs> uh I want to. Decent, I, I need an Alembic upgrade, but you don't have a good Alembic upgrade. All right, um. Be seeing you. Toodles. I'm just gonna vanish. Is she keeping me within eyesight? I think she's following me around, yep. Okay, so the shopkeepers can, can like, see you, even if you go invisible, which annoys me. So, like, if I want to sneak in here, I got to do so after hours. <sighs> but I really want the Cyrodiilic brandy! But I don't want to pay for it. That's a lot. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to go step, um... 
outside. If this was Morrowind, I would have been like, okay, I'm gonna somehow get up on top of the roof and there's probably, uh, like a roof entrance. Huh. Okay, so we know where to get the Cyrodiilic Brandy. We just can't because the freaking AI in the game can see you even when you're invisible. Because I wanted to, like, get invisible, just get slightly out of sight, and use, like, my, my telekinesis to pick the item up off the... I wonder if I can still pull that off. Okay, let's, let's quick save. You can still see me. I'm gonna lead you over here. All right, now I'm gonna come over here. Can you uh, come talk to me? Huh. Okay. If I invisify. Okay, if I get slightly out of, out of. Darn it. She gets me within sight really quick. If I go into the private quarters. Maybe if I wait up here for a bit. Actually, wait, she might have some up here. I still am novice alembic. Come on. All right, so she doesn't seem to have any up in, up in her room. What time is it? Okay, 12.04. I'm going to wait about an hour. It's going to chill for like an hour up here and see if her uh, AI uh, resets. Maybe I just need to be out of out of herself for a little while. Uh, for her to, uh, to, to, I don't know, go look at something different. Uh, I don't think I've ever, um, done it on camera. Actually, I don't, th actually, I've never done it before. I've always sort of, I've already suspected that you can't do it while, uh, trespassing, but I tried hitting wait, and it says you cannot wait while trespassing. I figured that was, it's kind of a given, but I don't think I've actually shown that on video, uh, during this entire playthrough, because it's never happened before. So I figured I'd just draw attention to it now, because I could. Things. Okay, I'm going back to waiting. All right. It's been like a solid hour. I can still he still hear you moving. Yeah. Ah, uh, she's still. She's still aware of me. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go find an inn. No, we don't need to find an inn. Yes, you do. Uh, okay. We're gonna go find an inn right nearby. And we're gonna rest. We're gonna sleep until closing time. And then once we once it's closing time, then we uh, go on in and we break into all the places. We're gonna go Which into Thornier's so place, and we're gonna break into um, her place to get the the brandy. So yes. merchants in. So have you bet on any arena match? Hey, oh, do you happen to have any? Probably expensive here though. Like after seeing that price, I'm like, eh. Uh, what is it? What do you want? I want to level up and wait until, uh, evening. I do have a bed available for 20 gold a night. Would you like to rent it? It's kind of steep, but sure. Very good. It's up the stairs there. First door on your left. Sleep well. First good door day. on the left. Uh, right here. Wooden door. Oh! Man, it's been ages since we've been here. Oh, where's the shackles? Our wrist irons. Can I put them back on? Apparently, you can like enchant these, and uh, I was I was told like like hang on to them. Um. Ah. Wait. Huh. Maybe that's not them. I, I I seem to remember being told that they weigh nothing and they take up like a unique item slot, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Right, I'll leave them there for now. At least they didn't uh, despawn. That that was back when we first started the game. So that tells me that if I leave something on in a small cell like this, um, it's not going to despawn, which is cool. Good to know. Anything respawn in these chests? No. The food seems to be all back, though. Great. I guess I paid for mead. I mean, I guess you kind of get your money's worth out of the, the items that spawn with it. Kind of, right? Maybe. All right, let's... Let's nap until nighttime. Level up. 
Uh, and, uh, then we will, uh, start robbing places! Um, five hours? Four hours. I'd like to be early. You have ascended to level 24! The results of hard work and dedication always look like luck, but you know you've earned every ounce of your success! Personality, four points. Yes, please. Strength, three points. Yes, please. And then what are we going to put the other points in? Um, I guess we'll go with willpower. I mean, endurance is the one that's really lagging behind, but ultimately, Alexis is just a squishy character. Um, agility would be great, too, for, like, the sneak and everything, but willpower is the lowest of the other stats outside of endurance, but endurance, I feel like I don't get the full... Um, benefit of it until, like, unless you get every 10 points. Yeah, but at the same time, you still do get some health, right? From putting points into endurance. But willpower, uh, affects how quickly you regenerate magicka and how much fatigue you have. Which is great for, you know, punching things and casting magic, so... Hmm. Alright, fine, I'll put the point into endurance. No, willpower. No endurance. No will- uh, uh... I put the point into Endurance. Put it up to 64. Alright. Mmm, sure. Exit. Alright. Night is upon us. Let us go break into places. moo ha ha hee ha ha Hey! Wait, I should not be drawing attention to myself. I'm not here. Ignore me. This is your basement. Uh, yep. I'm, I'm, I'm just going out this way. Don't mind me. Alright. The sun is setting. It is time to, uh, break into places. Hello. I understand the fighters Sneak skill increased. Perfect. Not bad work. Ah, crap. The, the, the golden caraf- carafe? I've heard others carafe. The it's over this way, right? I think. The gilded carafe. Car- <clears throat> Yeah. That. All right, we're just gonna wait around until they actually close. Uh, I don't know what time you actually close. Is there a way of checking? No. We just gotta wait and see. Sounds good. Uh, let's wait another hour. Seven thirty. Nope, still not closed. Eight thirty. Okay, it's closed. Eight thirty is when you. You didn't even notice me. Interesting. Where is she going? Actually, I should have been following Thorinir. Actually, yeah, I should have been following Thorinir. That's Thorinir right there, right? Okay, crap. We'll have plenty of time. I recognize Thorinir. Let's follow him. Where does he go? He goes to the Merchant's Inn. Illusion skill increased. Okay, so he comes to the Merchant's Inn, and, uh, what's he doing? He sits down and eat, he eats something. I think I'm supposed to, yeah, I'm supposed to be tailing him. Whoa, he made those apples move. Yeah, I guess we're just gonna hang out and watch him. Good to see you. Yes. Any new books you've been reading? Oh. I've been trying to get How through do you do? mysterious act affairs. Is all it's in a fairly uproar. interesting movie. I believe I, I read that some time ago. About the end of the I'll world. have to give it another read. Why, I never knew. Farewell. Indeed. Any time now. Good night. Good news see from Kavach for a change. Holy the last of the Daedra have been driven out. Fine. Take Holy care. Holy crap, there's Take so care. much chatter. It's a really busy place after hours. All right, now it's quiet. Oh, all these slurping and chewing noises are driving me crazy. Oh, it's you. If you need to get rid of something quickly, check out the copious coin purse. Thorinir isn't too picky, which is nice. <sighs> Be seeing you. Wait, if you need to get rid of something quickly... Is he, like... A non-thieves guild fence? Is that what's going on? Is it stolen goods? Keep talking, people. 
Wait, who who said that? I want to talk to somebody. Who who? Maybe I should ask around. Hey, how's it going? What do you want? Was it you talking about? Never mind. You don't have it as a topic. You too. Oh, it was Bridget. you. It might have been you. Heard any you. news lately? Samuel Bantian used to be a wild one. one. They say he Such used grace. to be quite the locksmith. He's calmed down she a lot. Like a Can toad. still teach you how to pick She'll a lock, though. Teach others how to. <sighs> have you? A pleasure to speak with you. Wait, I recognize you, that name. No, you don't have anything to say either. Goodbye. I try not to eat that. At least. Hi there. I needed some cash, so I went to see Jensine. She gives good prices for your old equipment. <coughs> What's the news from the other parts of Tamriel? Oh, what the crap? Nothing I'd like to talk about. I feel like I was about to get some information. Goodbye. Wait, did he did he have a whole bowl of like fruit in front of him? How do you do? If you're looking for books, first edition is the only place in the city to find them. It's a shame all the smaller bookstores are gone. I guess they just couldn't compete. So I've heard. Do you believe any of that talk about more oblivion gates opening all over the place? No, sir. There's a new ship moored up in the waterfront district. Oh, he's off. The Marie Elena. All right, let's see where Thorinir's off to now. Gonna. Are, are you heading back to your place? No, he's going somewhere else. Hey, whatever you're gonna do, could you do a little bit quicker? I I'd like to be able to uh, rob uh, Claudette real, real quick. What are you doing, dude? Oh, he's just waiting over here. All right, I'm just gonna. I'll take up a spot back here behind this bush. with this bright light that shines up every once in a while. I've got to get myself, uh, I've got to get myself some, some a decent chameleon spell now. I feel like my, my illusion is probably high enough. Where is my illusion skill at? I feel like we, we've, we've beefed that up a bit. We're up to 66. Nothing I'd like to talk about. Oh. We've got someone. Something's about to go down. Are you like guys in love or something? Like, like they're just staring into into, into each other's eyes. You, gonna, you guys gonna talk? Do I need to get close? Will that trigger it if I get closer? That you, Agamir? Shh! Not so loud. How many times have I told you that? Sorry, I am not used to this kind of meeting. It always makes me nervous. Well, just shut up and listen to me. The next shipment will be sooner than I expected. Just have the money ready. Same assortment of things? I mean, I have enough clothing for now. You take what I get. I get notice at the last second, and I have to jump on it. No time to be picky about it. Well, that society is putting more pressure on me, so maybe we better cut back for a while. You cut back now, and I'm going to take my business elsewhere. Or maybe pay a visit to that Jen scene and tell her about your little scheme. Fine. You made your point. Contact me when you have the items, and we'll meet again. Don't worry. It'll be very soon. Now get out of here.
Holy crap, it locked me in place. Okay, I had to get close. So I had to get to a, a place where I was very clearly visible. And then it locked me in place. So I, I had to watch the whole cutscene. That would have worked out so much better if I could have just stayed back behind the bush and they would have just had their conversation as normal. But no, they had... Mm, I'm, I'm getting irritated with the game again. I'm getting irritated with the game again. It's a different kind of irritated, though. Okay, I've observed a meeting between Thorinir and a mysterious man named uh, Agarmir. Looks like my new target is uh, Agarmir. I should follow him and see where he goes. Oh, they saw me. That's cool. They wouldn't have if I could have hidden over there. There was a bit of a flash, though, so I'm assuming that every time I cast, I, I become visible again for a second. Alright, let's follow this guy. What the- Holy crap, you went through that door quick! Like, from far away? It's like he just teleports through the door? From distance? Like, that's some- that is- that is some talent. Okay, so he's at, he's at least walking up to this this door a little bit closer. What the heck? I just heard something splash in the water. Is that a guard? Oh, crap, I want to watch the guard in the water. Okay. Okay, let me let me let me, let me make a note on my map. Um, right here. See if that guard drowns. I'm kind of curious to come back and see how, how the, the guard is doing. I just hear a splash. I'm like, wait a second, what was that? <laughs> Holy crap. This game. Okay, so you, I've discovered that uh, Agarmir has a house in Talos Plaza. I should go inside when he's not around and investigate. Alright, so during the day? Sounds good. Let's head back and get that Cyrodiilic brandy. And then we'll come back during the day and, uh, ransack his house. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Let's do that. Okay. There's one person over there that I, I need to worry about, but, uh, I've got a pillar between me and her, so it should be good. Let's bust in. All right, uh, so for all that, Cyrodiilic Brandy, you know what, I'm grabbing both. We're good, we've got both. Did you ever come back home? I'm kind of curious. Private quarters. Okay, yeah, she, she came back home. Oh, there's a chest behind your bed. All right, uh, so we're good. Uh, do you have any good, like, alchemy, uh, instruments down in the basement? Did I unlock the doors, or did, uh, or did she just leave them unlocked? Oh, she's got Harada. I mean, for, like, that's, that's, that's stuff from Oblivion. So she's got a bit of a selection. That's cool. Alright, let's get out of here. You know what? Uh, where's the, the, uh, the, the copious coin purse, or whatever the heck it's called? Um... First edition, it's over here. There's a guard right there. Can I, can I be hit? I, I can, I can hide myself pretty well in here. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go into this place. All right, so he's probably upstairs, sleeping. Let's send a message. Mm. Yeah, that's right. Stolen goods and crap. Ooh, paintbrushes. Okay, we'll take the paintbrushes. But everything else? Yeah. With basket, with fruit, all over the place. This is what happens when you mess with the people and the stuff. <laughs> Can, can I, uh, 
punch things? Oh, yes! Yeah, we can destroy this place in style. Eh. There! I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm just like, you know what? I haven't just like... There we, I, I just feel like I'm, I'm, I'm sending a message or something to... <laughs> uh... Oh, fold the cloth? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. yeah. Take that off there. Throw that on the ground. Pumpkins! We're gonna smash some pumpkins! Yeah! Um... Oh... Yep. Throw things across the room. Oh, uh, what have you got over here? Aw, quills. Tan jug. Planter. Um... There. Yeah. And... Eh. <laughs> I don't know why I was so amused by this. I was just like, yep. There we go. Mm. We've, uh... I think, I think, I think we've made ourselves very clear. Don't you? Oh, cool. Oh, cool! The cloth is actually hanging on the thing. That's cool. There we go. There we go. They hired the right person for the job. <laughs> I just thought it feels like such a jerk. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. If he's, like, fencing, like, stolen goods, and if that is... Well, maybe it is Thieves Guild. <laughs> what, what if I... Uh, what if I messed up, like, a Thieves Guild operation? It's like, ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> Alex is just an agent of chaos. <laughs> Alright, so we've gotten uh, what we need. Uh, I guess we just need to wait until morning. Hmm. I feel like I'm gonna need to feed again soon. Let's go check on that, uh, that guard. Oh. <laughs> he fell in again. <laughs> okay. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? This, uh, this, uh, Aga whatever guy. Um, he might be a shady guy, right? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, uh, uh Agarmir, Agarmir's house. It appears that Agarmir's home, and the door is barred from the inside? Darn it, I was gonna, like, I was gonna feed. Oh, uh, well. I guess we'll just have to wait until morning. You have my ears. All right, we're gonna have to end things here in front of this, uh, fabulous dragon. Uh, I'm out of time, so if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, I'm sorry, leave it a thumbs down. Either way, let me know what you thought in the comment section. Next time, uh, we're going to continue on with that quest, and uh, eventually, um, the, the Sanguine quest with the Cyrodiilic Brandy that we now got. Yeah! Um, but until that time, I would like to ask you all to game on.